guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, um, welcome, you know. And this video is going to be a short one, uh, which is my first impression of Chrissy Teigen's Cravings Cookbook. Ah! I just got this last week because I graduated with first class and my university like sponsored a 150 ringgit book reward so we could get any book that we want and claim it from them so I decided to get ta -da, Chris Teigen's Cravings Hungry for More if you didn't know I am a big big fan of her cookbook and I actually bought her first um, cravings cookbook and I made like a ton of her recipes already I made YouTube videos of it check it out I will link it in the description box below of all the recipes that I tried I feel like this um, cookbook is like different from the first one this one had a lot of cheese in it like a lot of uh, american recipes but it was really really easy to make a lot of the dishes are spicy but for me i don't like to eat spicy and when i omit all the spiciness it still tasted really really good and i assume this one would be as well so i'm just going to show you like um some of the recipes that I decided that I want to try. All right, so without further ado, let's look through the recipes. Okay, so this is the um, table of contents. This is the book. And here we have the breakfast and lunch, a uh, brunch section. And here is the soups, salads, and sandwiches. If the meal is vegetarian, it would have this logo. And okay, next is snacks potatoes and their friends, Thai mom, supper, and sweets. So you can see that um, it has a lot more potato recipes than the previous book. Um, there is the sweet section, which I don't remember. And there are there is the snack section as well, which is awesome. So the first thing is French toast with whipped honey and ricotta topping. Oh my god, so amazing. And the second one, which is what I'm very excited about, is this um, blueberry cream cheese pancakes, which is this so nice. Cannot wait to make it. Okay, moving forward is this um, oh, peppers garlicky bacon scramble, which looks super nice, by the way. And another one is. Oh, this egg mo mozzarella ham cups. I already have like a little muffin pan, so this is just awesome. Another one, which is similar, is the croissant bread pudding ham cups. Oh my god, it looks so delicious. I'm gonna buy croissants now. Uh, oh, this one looks great also. This one looks awesome as well. Oh, okay. Can't wait to make this salted maple granola, which I think is awesome. Creamy tomato soup, and the picture is here. Is this one with like Parmesan chips, which is this. It's awesome. Um, Parmesan minestrone, minestrone or minestrone? I'm not sure. And it looks like this, which is awesome. Clam chowder. Carrot coconut soup, which is great as well. Mm. Okay, these are all the salad which I did not um, choose because the rest just looks more awesome. Sweet and spicy peach and brie cheese toasties. Look at this. Oh my god. Uh, I'm so hungry. Okay, crispy bacon and sweet sweet pickle patty melts. I made her tuna melts um, from the previous book and it was awesome. So I cannot wait to try this one. Um, okay, so many sandwiches. Oh, snacks. Snack time. Okay, this is what I'm waiting to try. This awesome, awesome um, chicken wing. I feel like this cookbook has more chicken than the previous one which is awesome um, okay onion dip and oven baked potato crisps it's a good alternative for 
um, potato chips, I feel. And this is the mushroom and crispy salad. Shallot. Oh, fluffy corn dogs. Oh my god. I'm not a corn dog person though. Okay, here are all the um, potato, sweet potato wedges. This I need to try. Nice. And salt and vinegar baked chips. Looks awesome. Tater, shrooms, and peas, which is this. It's, I think this could be a really, really good side dish for Christmas. Spicy honey butter carrot coins. Awesome. Oh, garlicky cauliflower rice, which I think I need to try. Um, okay, cheddar chorizo broccoli rice and tomato bowls, which looks yummy. I love tomatoes. Cheesy chicken milanese. This looks awesome, by the way. Mm. Okay, oh, prawn time. Garlic honey prawns. Wow, looks so good. Makes me want to eat it right now. And then there is the garlicky wet salty spinach. Oh no, this one. Parmesan chicken breast. Okay, the last one is this three ingredient chocolate mousse with salty rice, crispy hazelnut crackle. Mmm. And that's about it, guys. Ta da! Done. So yeah, those are all the top choices of all the recipes that I want to make first from her new cookbook. If you have any specific recipes that you want me to try, I can make like a special video for it. Otherwise, I'll do like a one week of cooking Chrissy Teigen's uh, recipes, which is the same as my previous video. I really, really like the recipes in this cookbook and I do think that it's really, really easy to make, although um, I have certain limitations on some recipes because I don't have a cast iron skillet and I also don't have a food processor so yeah it's only a few recipes not that much um, also I don't eat spicy so I am going to kind of like tweak some of the recipes according to what I like or according to my taste uh, this is a learning experience for me and it's also a fun and just it's just something fun. And yeah, I hope that you like this first impression video. And if you want to see more, do click subscribe. And I hope to see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.